We're shamans. Okay. We're shamans in what we do, you know. That's the endeavour of being creative, you know. Like, I think if man wanted to make mad peas, we should have done something else. We would have gone into finance or law. We would have bodied that too. Do you find that art too difficult? Mm, no, because I just speak my truth. I think it would have been harder if I was trying to be, you know, certain I'm not in the pieces I make and then in the pieces you make, I've, it's the same thing, I think. Of course, the reason I ask that though is because there's so many new artists coming out of nowhere. Yeah, there is. But I think that's okay because I think people have things that they want to get off their chest mm -hmm. or they want to say. Mm -hmm. You know, I think there's nothing wrong with that. There's room for everyone. There's room for everybody to exist. I think it's the same in society. There's room for everyone to have an adequate standard of living and access to education and healthcare. And, you know, that's not a fantasy. It's crazy. I mean, as long as there's a message, then. Yeah, it makes sense. So I don't think, I think what's hardest is, I think, ref looking in the mirror and being honest with what you're doing and what we're doing. I think that that's actually the hardest. And being sincere, because yeah, you've got to be vulnerable, facts, facts. you know? When you talk about certain things that either you've been through personally or seeing people in your community go through, that's quite sensitive mm. and delicate. And you can't just, I don't know, you can't just like, yeah, you can't just be surface level. Yeah. Got to think about the reasons why we do this. Mm. Why do you do it? Honestly? to hopefully inspire people from areas that I'm from, mm. to see problems and challenges we have in society and be inspired to take on those challenges and address them. And their way might not be through art, it might be through you know them being in youth politics or them yeah. being a doctor or an engineer, but because I understand art is like the gift God has given us, me, mm -hmm. and also it's what you know, we're a gen visual generation with the internet and stuff. It's the easiest way I could communicate. Like those things I read in psychology when I was studying that, those heavy texts, the texts we read on websites are heavy. No one's gonna scroll through them. So that's it, you? Um, the reason I do this is, it's almost like a catharsis for me. Mm. I find making art therapeutic mm. and I enjoy it, you know. Mm. I like making art that has a message. And mm. I'm big you are so not, if people take it in and understand it, then that's its own thing, you know, working out what it actually means, what the artwork means, and also just, I want to make it out of the hood, man. Facts, 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 facts. But we're not trying to go alone. We're not trying to go alone. We've got to take the hood with us, because the art world could do with a little, I don't even like calling it hood, or just, just local, you could just do with normal people. You know, people that just, you know, they have their toast slightly toasted with a little bit of beans and butter. A little something. A little something. They just want to go home and have a healthy family, not trying to do too much. So yeah, we, we need normal normal people in these institutions and these spaces. Yeah. What are like your end goals? What, what is it you want to achieve after we go clear with it? What are some things you want to do? Bro, just community centres, yeah. daycare centres that mothers can drop their kids off at affordable rates. Just things that actually foster healthy mm -hmm. social infrastructure. Improve our, improve our community, improve like so society, really. Mm -hmm. In the whole tapestry of art, we're just a blip. This period we're in is a blip. There was people before us, there's gonna be people after us. Of course, of course. So if we can take our gift, do it, but then also actually affect society positively with either revenue or you know the conversation we're having and that that's forever